What's up Safehoon Army, it's Crypto Ben bringing you the latest news about Safehoon. Looks like guys we have new hints about the blockchain. So if you didn't know, the main developer of Safehoon is hinting at Safehoon making their own blockchain. So we're gonna explore what's what's been happening to Safe for the last couple of days here. So here we are in CoinMarket Cap. Let's check out what's been happening to this coin for the last couple of hours, the last couple of days. But before we start, we have to talk about Crypto Benny here. Guys, thank you so much for following and watching this channel. It really does mean so much to me. We're at 23,000 and 600 subscribers let's go to the 25k mark we're pretty close here and we can do it i know we can it means so much to me if you can subscribe to the channel and like this video it really does help this channel to grow and to continue to go up and go to the moon basically here as you can see we're 2.3 almost 2.4 billion mark up here which is still pretty okay so we are three percent down the volume is pretty much 60% up, so that's pretty good. So volume 30 million dollars, so that's pretty okay. We're so close. We need 5,000 more watch lists, and then we're gonna have 1.5 million watch lists. So that's gonna be amazing here for SafeMoon. If you do look at the chart here for a couple of seconds, you can see that basically, like I said, stabilization. So a lot of stabilization is still happening for this coin, and we have, we knew about this. We know we're gonna stabilize for the next couple of days here. We're, it should be stabilized for like the next six to seven days maybe even so we're gonna see what's gonna happen but if you go here to the markets these are all the exchanges where you can buy the coin if you do want so so there you go but watch out some of these like a lot of these exchanges do not have uh the tokenomics so just be careful about that but let's continue let's get into the news so if you go here to the twitter here to save on twitter 868,000 followers so almost 870k so pretty close like i said every day we're getting close to that 900k Number so that's awesome to see, but this here is their only latest post saying who's going to the safe moon, and there you go. So, almost 20k likes here, that's amazing to see. Pretty cool to see here, but let's continue. Let's go into the nitty gritty, let's go into the real news for today. So, here in the ready page, so tell me the screenshot this saying is safe on blockchain trending yet? It should be. Uh, explain to me, like, I'm a 24 year old, the crypto investor with just enough knowledge to. I don't know what he wanted to continue here, but yeah. It says, when testing Solidity in a local smart chain using Kanachi, Truffle gets angry if a reference contract isn't declared abstract. When it could be. Now I have a local blockchain, Truffle, safe from contract, and everything I need to launch it all with one line. Let's see what other people that talk about this says here. I know all of those words, but when they're in that order, I have no idea what it means. I opened the comments so I could write something into this exact same method, but you beat me to it. Do you really want it trending right now? A wall isn't even out yet, man. Jumping the gun creates FUD. Your words of wisdom speak volume. So yeah, that's the biggest problem. So we do not want to spread FUD because we don't even have the wallet. So I still think the blockchain is in the works. Like it's slowly trying to be become an idea here. I think in the future they will probably make a blockchain but like i said in my previous videos it's probably not going to be anytime soon here so we're going to have to wait so we're going to have to wait for some time here until something like that does happen but we have even more things here so more screenshots so let me just find it here it should be there you go so this is the latest i think screenshot yes it says now so uh 1000 papa in the meta mask when in global domination there you go 1000 papa <laughs> i think this should be the blockchain basically or like they're making something we're gonna see something is happening here to save one and it's pretty interesting but we're gonna see we want to see the comments here about this post here it says how lucky are we to uh, have this man at the helm this wouldn't have taken off like this without him papa's reputation precedes him he's a smart man uh, turns down a couple millions from another coin to stay here he knows where this is going can't wait to enjoy the ride so not just any coin ripple there you go. So yeah, if you didn't know, uh, Papa basically Ripple wanted to hire Papa to be one of the one of his develop one of their developers, but he refused and he started to join Safemoon. So it says Papa seems to be very active with the community lately. I'll take that as a good sign. <laughs> there you go. I can't tell what he's doing. Is he running a blockchain testnet called Papa? From this picture, it could be as simple as creating his own token of Ganesh. It takes two minutes to download, set up and connect a wallet on a local host. Pretty much what you see in the above shot. 
So he basically takes testing coins now. The fact that Safemoon has a team of people who aren't hiding their identities alone is a reason to believe in it. Uh, look at most of the other coins. They don't even tell you who is behind the scenes or the person in charge who knows nothing about cryptocurrency. I saw one new coin and they bragged about how they revealed the identities of the team and it's a bunch of guys in sunglasses and fake beards not even joking. <laughs> There you go. This is why Safe Moon is awesome because Safe Moon is transparent. We have so much more transparency in Safe Moon than so many other coins, like especially the newest coins. So Safe Moon, I think from if you look at the newest coins, the newest standard of coins, you can just see that basically Safe Moon here is the most transparent. They're always talking about what they're doing, their plans and future ideas for the coin. This is why it's so important. Oh, we have the whale watching today. I forgot about this, but let's continue. This is whale watching day 64. Safeun family. Another day of minor price change. Currently, it looks uh, like we are down 0.2%, which is barely anything. This will be day number 9 of our stagnant period, which should honestly be of no surprise to anyone who has been following my post. Feel free to look at yesterday's post about our pattern and the fact that we still have a few more days before we can expect any large movements. The whales dropped down about 200 billion, which I mentioned before has become the daily average for our whale friends. The burn pile also grew by a by about 90 billion. All of this is a nice steady burn and redistribution. Over the weekend, I made mention of Papa probably going to start dropping some teasers as we head into the ne end of the week, and sure enough, he is. So there you go. And my bro here, the whale watcher, knows that Papa has just been throwing bombshells down <laughs> our throats. But yeah, it says recently he has been hitting at a safe on blockchain, which would be a true game changer. John is in Gambia now, and one can only imagine the conversations that are taking place over there. I really look forward to this week's AMA to get an update on all the different projects that the dev team has been working on. So, Papa sh <laughs> like showing us some hints, like bombarding us actually with hints, and John, the CEO, is in Gambia. So, yeah, probably talking with the governors there and seeing what could happen with safe one in Gambia. So final thoughts, nothing too surprising today. We had a cute little jump in price and I bet most of you thought it was time for launch or the past 24 hours, all, all of the 50, top 50 coins are showing green and it makes me excited to see the market recovering as a whole. Bitcoin is up to where it was almost two weeks ago, so I feel like we have created a strong floor. Based on previous trends, I am not too worried about uh, my investment since it seems that the price has finally stopped dropping. I know it sucks that we are down or 50% from the all-time high, but Safemoon is an extremely quick mover. We could see a new all-time high within a couple of days of growth, we just need a strong catalyst to ignite our rockets. There are about a half a dozen of them on the horizon and I truly feel that we could see the ignition as we roll into the weekend. Only time will tell, so I'm just going to sit back and continue to wait to see what happens. Friday is payday, so I hope we can wait until then so I can buy some more tokens before our next jump. So there you go. There you go, guys. Basically, stabilization. Stabilization. So we are still stabilizing for this coin. And we're going to continue to stabilize until the crypto market does pretty much recover here. So some time. Like some time needs to pass until that happens. Papa is a man of focus, commitment, and sheer will. There you go. I'm not going to watch this video, but yeah. Because it's going to get copyrighted. It says, my goal is when Stapen reaches my price. It says, when Stapen reaches my price goal, I don't want to lambo. I want to open up one of a kind gym. And many people who see working out are actually there because they are hurting on the inside and use the gym as a therapy. I want to help heal those souls. Oh, that's awesome. It's pretty cool, bro. It's gonna be awesome pretty much in the future. Let's so see, just made 2k from EMC option call. Can you guess where that money is going? Oh, safe moon. <laughs> oh, it's going into safe moon. There you go. Well, let's continue. Let, yeah, the stock market is being a lot more crazy. It says here, meanwhile, in Gambia. <laughs> nice Photoshop. And owls. We got the owls. It looks like we're gonna have the secret owl project. It's not gonna be pre Project Phoenix anymore, but owl project, it looks like. The, the devs here have been really. For, for some reason, pointing to owls. I don't know why, but we're gonna see. So, so what are you guys' thoughts on the safe and blockchain? Yeah, block theory. So, there you go. So, so let's uh, take this into account. One, testing a smart chain. 
a reference contract, a local blockchain, Harmony Bridge, Solidity Movements, Libraries Move. I believe it is the initiator of a safe moon blockchain. What to you? I'm thinking it's true. I'm also thinking they will uh, push for new coins to use their blockchain to come on their exchange, which I'm assuming will introduce tokenomics into other cryptos, therefore creating this crypt uh, cryptonomics they are talking about will really change the game and face a lot of big hands to keep up with competition. They go. Pretty awesome. Pretty awesome. What do you guys think? Is the blockchain real? Are they working on a blockchain or are they working on something else? Put it down, guys, in the comments. What do you think what safe moon is really trying to make here? So what are they working on truly? It says here, if this doesn't give you hope for safe moon, then I don't know what will. So oh, what is this? From ICO to the moon, the path of promising tokens. Oversell doubts, first big sell off, panic, team begins to develop uh, to deliver. Oh, holders, yeah. Team begins to deliver real growth, possible moon. Product is adopted based on its merits. So, is this from Minnesota? I think it's important to point out that this chart is from 2018. It's not a chart about Safe Moon, but Safe Moon fits perfectly. It's just a general outlook on promising tokens such as Safe Moon. Oh, okay. Okay, I'm like, what? They're talking about Safe Moon? No, nah, not really. So we just photoshopped it here, but still pretty cool, pretty cool to see. But yeah, I still think here like the community here just awesome. This is why I love Safe Moon because the community just wants to stay here. They're gonna huddle, they're gonna hold this coin for the longest times. Birthday Safe Moon. This hi guys, it turned 17. I've been watching Safe for a month now. Wanted to get it on on it. I asked my parents for uh, for nothing but cash and put 100% of it into Safe Moon. I got my first. 15 million coins awesome i'm planning to hold for 10 years or more glad to be here to huddle to hold with you guys so fun to watch my coins getting more coins awesome welcome to the community thank you and happy birthday awesome guys this is why i love the community but let's go let's go to the chart here so i'm using today a different chart we're on dex.guru because for some reason it doesn't uh, the other one doesn't work for me so i use bitmart mostly and the charts are not the same so I think Dex Guru just shows you how different it is, but you just see a lot of difference here. A lot of difference. Like we had a new all-time high here plus, but now we did stabilize a lot. So this drop here that I had before, it's super dropped all the way down. So what do you guys think? Should I use Dex uh, Guru or should I use the other one, Bitmart? So what do you guys think? What is the better one for to, to do for some analysis? So. What I'm seeing here is absolutely nothing, just kidding, but we are still making like this triangle here. We do have this tri giant triangle that's been forming, but what could happen? We're going to see a, a lot of support, guys. Look at the support we have for this area. There you go. So much support, but still we're inside of this giant triangle that's been forming. And we have two options. One is, of course, we can break to the downside. If we do break to the downside, what's going to happen? We're going to hit all the way down to here, probably, to this level. But what I think is, good is that we're going to rebound, and then we're going to stabilize in this area. Or if we do drop a little bit, we're going to drop just in this area. So either we're going to drop all the way to here, then rebound, stabilization in this area, or, or we're just going to drop over here, and that's it. The stabilize to there. But hopefully we don't. Hopefully we do break to the top side, because if we do, I'm going to hit this level and then stabilize here. That's going to mean if you do from here to here, 25% increase. So 25% increase in stabilization. If that happens to Safoon, it's going to be awesome. That's really good news for Safoon. And that will be a really good level to be at next time. So in the future here. Hopefully we do. Hopefully we do break the top side of this triangle here and we do go up a little bit. But like I said, and like the whale watcher guy said, basically stabilization. For the next couple of days, we're going to see... A lot of stabilization or till some major news comes out we, we're just gonna need gonna need a catalyst guys yeah we had a lot of volume here like i said we're just gonna need a lot more catalyst for this coin so something needs to happen we're gonna need some new news probably it's gonna be this week in the ama hopefully we got some awesome news when john when john comes back and we're gonna see what's going to happen here but guys like i said i'm not a financial advisor if you want to buy these coins please do your own research first if you did enjoy this video it means so much to me if you can like this video comment down below and subscribe to my channel thank you so much for watching and see you guys in the next video